Hey guys, today I'm going to show you a semi. A semi is a cicada. That's how you say cicada in Japanese. You see semi. This is of course a fake semi. This is a little statue, a little carving. I'm not sure what it's made out of, but it's one of, uh, I really like it. I picked it up at a flea market quite a while ago. It's um, quite intricately carved, as you can see. And every year we have annual cicada. There's quite a few things I learned about cicada when I was um, preparing this video. I thought I should, you know, look up some stuff since I don't know anything. But um, cicada in Japan are annual, but uh, in some parts I think of America, they're every 13 years and every 17 years. Apparently that's to fend off um, predators. Like some predators just can't live that long. I don't really understand that because there'll be new predators, but I don't really get it. Apparently it's still a mystery. And I found out that a couple years ago they br they um, scientists breeded. Breeded, is that what you say? They mated. They got two. They got two cicadas. One is 17 year olds, a 17 um, cycle cicada, and a 13 year cycle cicada. They get them to mate. And they're gonna find out what happens. What that means is like they live. They come out of the ground uh, every 13 or 17 years, depending on the type. In America and in Japan, they come every year. But um, how do I say that? Some live. They live in the ground seven or eight years, and then they come out. But they're always coming out every year. There's a new generation coming out every year. And um, they don't bite. They're very noisy, uh, unlike crickets, who which rub their legs to make the noise. And you'll you'll hear the noise in a few minutes. These um, they have a kind of um, they have a chamber here on their back. If you can see on the back here, and only the males make noise. So they attract the females this way. Uh, they don't. Yeah, you know, I told you they don't bite or anything. Um, I think in, in the southern part of America they're called dry flies. I read, but anyway. Um, People eat them in China, but not in Japan. I've never heard of anyone eating them in Japan. Eat them, eat them in other parts of the world. And some of them get as long as six inches, so... I don't know what six inches is. These days I go by centimeters, so... I guess it's about that long. But in Japan, they're actually... You'll see in a few minutes. Anyway, a little trinket, a little token of it. I'll show you a little... Um, something that I like to... Like to have on my shelf. And here's a video. See you soon. Okay, I'm in the temple where I always go. And I've only got five minutes of film. I'm looking for a cicada shell, and a lot of them have dropped off. It rained yesterday, so but I found one. And here's an even better one. Look at this. This is one that I think the insect never escaped. The ants are kind of eating it. Maggie wants to play. What's up, Maggie? Huh? Wanna play? So the ants are eating this one up. The, this one never got out of his shell. As you can tell, he was trying to get out of his shell. And he never got out. So, poor guy. Another, a whole bunch over here. So you can tell here they got out. Okay. They got out of a shell there. Got out of a shell there. Right? There's one. Over there. People pray here every morning, so Maggie and I like to run around. It's usually empty, but really early in the morning, some older people come. Anyway, here are some. I found some shells and one that didn't get it out. Here they are. These three are empty. But this one, the little guy, didn't get out. So in there, you can see. Yes, he died. All right. Okay. Okay, that's, uh, I'm sure you could probably find all this out online, but uh, if you're watching me, if you never never knew any of this, 
Hope you learned something today. I gotta walk Maggie home now. It's gonna get really hot a little bit later. This is the only time we can go out before it's just too hot to handle. The poor girl really suffers. This is a typical small, narrow street in my neighborhood. I kind of live in an old part of town next to a new part of town. A little, what people do. Make sense. Just look how narrow these roads are. Right. Very narrow little roads. I'm always amazed by how narrow, narrow these roads are. Look at this, just uh, two meters wide. Two meters wide. There's no way a car could get through here. Ah, uh, maybe. I doubt it though. Yeah. There's a shit on set. Bullet train. Yeah. Pretty quiet, right? Okay. There's the new part of town. Over there. See the big building. That's what they look like when they just come out of their shell. Pretty gross, huh? Their wings are soft. They have to dry before they can fly. Okay, I gotta go now. Better show you a better picture of it. About it. Alrighty. Good color there, huh? Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go let this little guy go now. He only he'll only live how many days? Seven days. Seven days. Seven days. So he's got seven days to what? To have sex and have babies? What are they doing in seven days? I'll do some research, get back to you. Okay. Same? Give me a break, man. Give him a break because he's short and just one. And when he's back from his break, you'll see his parts made in Japan.